couple of years later, we moved to Liverpool late. Just after Thatcher got elected. Bad time. Where there is discord, may we bring harmony. Right, Where there is the error, out. may we bring Don't truth. Where there is doubt, Go on, then, sing may we bring faith. Where there is discord, Get it all up now. may Come we on. bring hope. But it didn't bother him, he hated the assembly line anyway. And he didn't let things get to him back then, my dad. Not, not then. Uh, so we moved again to my grand's just off Lodge Lane. And that's where I met these two scallies, Minty and Moose. Hey, you kid! You want to play buggy? Well, buggy. Okay. Gotta buy a ball first though. You got any cash? Do I look soft? Hey, it's only 69 people on Plaza from all my medicines. I've got 40 there. Alright, Moose! Alright, Minty. New kit, number 24. Alright. What's your name? Kenny. Sound. What are your two minutes Got 20 people at Plazzy. My job. He's Somali. Somalis are always big. Aren't they, Goose? Suppose. Only one real man. Only me and Kenny are allowed to kick the ball. Oh, come. She always burst you, big son. You can be goalie. Come on. Me, Moose, and Minty, we went on a coach. The team. <laughs> we died a few of his mates with there, you know, to keep an eye on us, but we got a pretty free run, really, you know. Minty kept us snapped up, working the service stations. Fingers like a brain surgeon. And I copped a feel from this bootle beard on the way. Colleen beard. Big girl. <laughs> nice girl. Wanna know what my chat up was? Hey, girl. Yeah. <laughs> I might have a draw you. You know your portrait like. Standing in the middle at a middle-aged man, and I'm thinking, this is probably your last chance. It's over 20 years since our last final. Oh, Zara, I'll be 20, 30 by the time the next one comes along, and I'll be gaga by then. And I decide, that's it. Gotta go. So I go in and I tell Marie, I wanna go, love. <laughs> Yeah, down this way here. Oh, that fucking stick wasn't there last time I was here. Even though Stanley fucking tramps and pigeons are there around here, like, I tell you, that's how when you want to get some fucking money back, you know, I tax the fucking tramps or the fucking pigeons. I mean, fucking make this place look a little bit fucking better. I don't know how they're fucking taxing with the pigeons, but like, I don't thought that one through yet, I tell you. Yeah, that's a nice bridge, we're on here. 
By the time we walk back into the station, we see the front of a train pulling out. <coughs> Sheffield. You fucking melt. We missed it. That's early, that late. It's only 20 past. What are you on about? It's gone, turn two. You watch us half an hour slow. No, Dad, don't I? We moved it back half an hour, give us more time. <laughs> you moved your watch back? Yeah. You fucking whopper. Worst days of my life. We're in this crappy station cap, Minty's off his head, chewing his lips raw, and we're sat in front of this smudgy TV. And suddenly, we're watching 96 people getting crushed to death. And people are chatting away, you know, ordering coffee and loudspeakers squawking out the train times. And then this railway lad starts coming onto this girl in the cafe, and Moose just loses it. Will you shut the fuck up? There's people dying here! goes quiet and suddenly everyone starts watching And I'm sat there thinking, thank fuck for the offie and the speed. Because we'd have been in the Leppens Lane and... We have a blast watching this Manx security guard, long face, staring at thousands of scousers about to go on the trip of a lifetime. He's in the middle of his shift and he is miserable as fuck. <laughs> He's only made the mistake of wearing his man new pin badge. <laughs> Fair game, eh? Pretty soon, he's surrounded. Yeah, excuse me, mate, could you tell me the difference between Alex Ferguson and God? No, go on, tell me. God doesn't think he's Alex Ferguson! <laughs> Hey mate, hey mate, hey what you say to a man you fan with a good looking woman on his arm there? Eh? Surprise me. Nice tattoo! <laughs> it's very good that, yeah. Very humorous, yeah. Hi, I'm Andrea and I'm joined up here by Sarah. <laughs> and if you go up the rear, you'll find Jenna and Michelle. Hey, she's got two women shoved up her ass! <laughs> May I just draw your attention to the emergency exit at the front, the window exit in the middle, and the further exit <laughs> in the rear. At least I got somewhere to get out from, I suppose! <laughs> Life jackets are situated under the seats and can be secured at the front. May I just remind ladies and gentlemen passengers not to inflate the life jacket whilst inside the aircraft. The life jacket can simply be inflated by tugging on the cord. Hey, Dad, looks like she's done that before, eh? <laughs> or orally, by using the tube. Thank you very much. <laughs> 